Right, the second race in Fakenham is the Sea Pigeon 3 mile handicap hurdle, 0 to 120 hurdle, Salabar Martin Leedham, Anna Capri, Stu Gray, Reign of Castamere, Pad Patrick Hogan, Russell Crowe, Patrick Hogan, Zephonic Gent, Graham Clattermuck, Pepe Militren, Darren French, and Three Jokers, Obi Wan, Seven Horses. In this hurdle from Fakenham, and away they go is Russell Crowe, who goes to the front for. Patrick Hogan. I don't think Russell Crowe is normally a front runner, but he has advantage at the moment from Salad Bar in second. Three Jokers for Obi Wan back in third. Then comes Stu Gross, Anna Capri. Uh, on the out wide outside is Reign of Castamere. On the inside of that is Pepe Militrian for. Uh, oh, a bad mistake by Pepe Militrian. Drops him to the back of the field with a Symphonic Gent on that one's inside. Then he forwards his first loss here as Russell Crowe sets a sedate gallop in front from Anna Capri on, that, on the rail. In between horses is Salad Bar. On the outside of Salad Bar is three jokers. Um, wide of the th three jokers is Reign of Castamere. Pepe Militron on the outside of that. And then Safonic Jen to the back of the field for Graham Clatterbuck as Russell Crowe takes them along. He had faken them. They're on the far side of the track now. With Anna Capri up on the inside of that. They jump the next. In between horses, Salad Bar has moved up into second. Then comes three jokers for Obi Wan. Uh, the yellow colours with a black cap on the outside of that is Reigns of Castamere. The yellow colours with the purple cap, that's Pepe Militron for Darren French. The red, white and green colours, that's uh, Saphonic Gen for Graham Clutterbuck. And the yellow colours with the black cap in front is Russell Crowe for Patrick Hogan. So Russell Crowe leads from Salad Bar in second for Martin Leedham. On the inside of that is Anna Capri for Stu Gray. Then comes uh, Three Jokers for Obi-Wan. He's just on the outside of Saphonic Gent and dropping to the back of the field now is uh, Three Jokers. He's been passed by both uh, Reigns of Castamere and Pepe Militron, who are out wide for Padre Cogan and Darren French, but it's the stable companion of Reign of Castamere, Russell Crowe leads. From Salad Bar in second. Then comes Reign of Castamere with Saphonic Gent on that one's inside. They're followed by Anna Capri with three jokers at the back of the field for Obi Wan. And it's about six cents first to loss as Russell Crowe takes him along. From Salad Bar in second. Then comes Saphonic Gent on the outside of. Um, it's probably Jenny's Reigns of Castamere with Pepe Militron on the outside of that. On the rail is Anna Capri for Stu Gray and at the back of the field three jokers for Obi Wan. So Russell Crowe. Four lengths to have Salad Bar in second. Saphonic Gent on that one's outside has moved through from the back of the field into third. Then comes the Obi Wan's three jokers on the inside of Reigns of Castamere. Pepe Militron has been wide the whole way for Darren French and always been on the rail is Anna Capri for Stu Gray, but now at the back of the field. But only about six lengths off this leader, Russell Crowe, as they jump the next. And Russell Crowe, the leader from Saphonic Gent in second. Then comes Salad Bar. Pepe Militron on that one's outside, followed by Rain with Castamere on the outside of uh, Three Jokers and Anna Capri at the back of the field. As they come past the stands, they're about to head off on their final circuit with Russell Crowe passing the winning post in front this time round. We've got one circuit left to travel. So Fonny Gent back in second. Then comes Salad Bar. Reigns of Castamere in between horses. Pepe Militron always been wide for Darren French. Three Jokers. One from last in the back of the field, Anna Capri, about six lengths off the leader, Russell Crowe, as they jump the next. So still this Patrick Cogan's Russell Crowe leads from Stable Companion, Reign of Castamere, has moved up into second. Saphonic Gent on that one's inside. Then comes the wide travelling Pepe Militron. Behind that is Salad Bar for Martin Leader. At the back of the field together now, three jokers and Anna Capri. They have almost a mile left to go. They got only three fences left to jump, and Russell Crowe, the leader from Reign of Castamere. Pepe Militron behind that for Darren French. Then Salad Bar on the outside of Zephonic Gent. They jump the next good jump there by Salad Bar. Anna Capri has moved past three jokers in the back of the field, but still all of them can win this. They're all in touch as Russell Crowe now being joined by stable companion Reigns of Castamere. Then comes Pepe Militron back in third. On the inside of that is Salad Bar, followed by Anna Capri, who has now passed Zephonic Gent, who's dropped to the back of the field. Three jokers on the outside of Zephonic Gent. 
They've got two fences left to go here. Yeah. Russell Crowe, the leader, from Reign of Castamere. There's still a long way to go there. Six furlongs left to travel as Russell Crowe is back in front from Reign of Castamere in second. Then comes Pepe Milligan. He's travelling well for Darren French back in third. Salabon has been pushed along to try and prove. Anna Capri is on the outside of Symphonic Jet and in the back of the field Street Joke has been pushed along to try and prove as they pass the four furlong for five furlong pole as Russell Crowe leads from Reign of Castamere in second. Pepe Melitron back in third. Then comes Salabar. Zaphonic Gent is running, is improving for Graham Clutterbuck, then followed by Anna Capri and three jokers. That's Russell Crowe who leads from Saphonic Gent is now moved into second. Reign of Castamere's channel seems to have petered out. Uh, so, uh, Pepe Militron starting to struggle now. Salad Bar on the inside of that. Then comes Anna Capri and three jokers. But Russell Crowe has led from start to finish. Still clear from Symphonic Gent and Reign of Castamere. Then Salad Bar and Pepe Militron. It's still Russell Crowe in front with two foes left to travel from Symphonic Gent and Reign of Castamere. Russell Crowe has led the whole way. Start with companion, companion and Reign of Castamere in second is the only likely challenger at the moment. And Russell Crowe has led them a merry dance here. And Russell Crowe is going to win for Patrick Hogan. He's well clear with half a foot left to travel. They're making no impression on this leader. Reign of Castamere is trying hard in second. It's Russell Crowe from Stabermate. Reign of Castamere. Then it's Sonic Gent. Russell Crowe needs the line, but it's going to hold on to win from Reign of Castamere. So Sonic Gent back in third. Salabar back in fourth. Then Pepe Melitron. They made no impression on this leader. Russell Crowe didn't set a fast pace. I don't think he's normally a front runner. There was no pacemaker in the field. Set his own fractions. Won comfortably in the end. From stablemate Reign of Castamere in second. Zephonic Gent was back in third for Graham Clutterbuck and Salabar fourth for Martin Leedham. So Patrick Hogan won two in the second from Fakenham.